right, so here today I wanted to talk about something pretty, pretty fun, because guess what? We're kicking into the fact that we just got some actual big news, right? Um, and that news being a literal, not even an extensive roadmap, like, dude, this is very extensive. Some games just give you a roadmap for like two months, maybe a month, maybe like the month itself. We got a roadmap for October, November, December. Damn, that's a lot actually, right? And I didn't expect to actually get that much information. We have a lot to expect, right? And in two of the things, we actually are now coming to conclusions for the aspect that we now have two confirmed characters. So we kind of know who's coming soon, right? Not officially confirmed, but for the most part, we can kind of guess. We, we can put two into together. We can put the blocks together and know that's what they're hinting at, right? So today, let's jump into it. If you're new to the channel, like and subscribe helps out a ton. Let's hop over there and let's check it out. So first thing, this is the dev notes. Again, we went through this. We understood everything. There's very simple things that you want to know also, right? They've already confirmed that. That their entire plan with this game is when they give you a story they're trying to also give you the sort of content um like character along with it that ties into the story you clearly saw we have the entire family festival here and we got the basic elder being Edon, right Edon, yeah we'll just go with it and kisia right both characters released because they were both part of the story and that was the entire event it was event based story based character based right it, it worked it went hand in hand that was the entire idea for it right now next up is going to be his story along with him as a character that's also their plan so they're going to give you some sort of side story uh, while also implementing him as a character they've already confirmed that that is their plan if we were to scroll down over here uh to the aspect of boom right here secret training right that's what the campaign story is so that's what you're going to be getting in october being the first banner is going to be ron let's let's establish that point very simple very easy now what's after that very simple also it says endorsee and the october illusion campaign now i was originally wondering because someone originally said on the kr forums and was pushing this as a point and then also global people that were kind of digging into the files did find that there is a child endorsee listed as a character and i was like how how, how is that operating? And I now put two and two together that you're getting the Endorsey October Illusion campaign. We were to scroll up over here. Endorsey and the October Illusion is an original story created by our dev team. In the story, we get a glimpse of Endorsey's new goal, which helped her endure vicious environments in which she grew up in. So the child Endorsey thing makes a lot of sense now. So I really wonder if we're actually getting child Endorsey as a character because it is currently being floated around as a full-blown leak. And so far, leaks have been very accurate on who you're getting. Um, now, I wonder how genuine this is for the aspect of how would child Endorsey work, right? Is she like a full-blown slaughterer in, in, in child state also? I'm very curious, but that is a sort of confirmation I give you today because yes, there are leaks floating around, but there is a child in Dorsey that exists. And again, this looks like to be her story. I also wonder what they're going to do for Halloween. Remember, it is a seasonal event, so probably we're going to get a lot of Halloween costumes and stuff like that. But again, they haven't really given us more of a deep dive on that. Clearly, you could see that they didn't talk about too much other than the campaign itself. That's it, right? Clearly, this entire October uh, roadmap isn't giving you everything because there's no way we're just getting one character in this entire thing. They just don't want to tell you who the next character is, but they, they basically told you giving you this, right? So it looks like, yes, Child and Dorsey coming soon um, is the idea because first off, that was the leak. Now you're putting two and two together, hearing a story. The entire story is about her and her entire uh, you know, state of when she was a child in the entire environment she grew up in. So it all works out and it'll be the way that they're doing this character. So let me know if you would summon for Child and Dorsey, okay? Beyond that, we have also kind of given us, uh, or they've given us an idea of November. November clearly tells you Rack's Strange Adventure, and they show us compressed Rack. Rock, how do you want to say it? And if you don't already know, he's already in the game. So if we go here to the listed characters that are currently uh, alive in the game, it is, in fact, Compressed Rack, right? He is a, a light character already in the game. This is not leaks or anything, but this is his kit. We already have knowledge of this guy existing, and all of a sudden, us getting a little bit of a story for him probably confirms that your character in November, that again being before or after the campaign story, being the character collaboration campaign, very much curious on what happens there. People are currently very much hyping that up. So again, do what you want with that information. But yes, this story does exist, and it would be really cool to see this character. A lot of people have been waiting for this character. Um, so there's a very high chance in November, either before or after the collaboration, um, this character will pop up because again, it's his story and it's literally showing you an emoji or a rather stamp or sticker, whatever you want to call it, of him himself. And that's why it's his strange adventure, I'm guessing, because he's 
adventuring as the compressed rack version hence why you know this is why we're getting the banner for him okay i've uh, realized that now it also pops up as this there's new teammates popping up all right an ssr plus and an ssr i think that he is the ssr and i think that they're going to somehow do some sort of ssr plus for the character collaboration it makes no sense the way they do it the other way i'm telling you the way that i see it is they're gonna make him an ssr plus but they better be like people are talking like some good points here uh, in my comment section saying like do it like other games that do legend rarity right collaboration characters are legend rarity where you don't need insane amount of dupes because they release to be this you only need like three to six dupes and it's filled out the character because they're of legendary rarity right so the word rarity I'm, I'm butchering it in different ways but it's fine but you know there you go so i wonder how this is going to go but yeah we're going to probably see rack over here in november Beyond that, you didn't get really too much of an idea for the uh, winter campaign, but most likely you're going to get like a, a sort of seasonal character for the entire thing, in my opinion. Um, again, I wonder, because Endorsey will be the first character like that, I think, in the game. That is a duplicate character, other than, you know, Bam and Bomb and Viol, right? Bomb and Viol is the same person, but Viol is obviously the upgraded version. So, like, just like that sort of aspect of it, it's instead of Endorsey, it's Child Endorsey, correct? So, it'll be like the first ever character similar to that. Um, I don't think, let me let me just open it on my right monitor here just to make sure. I don't think there's anybody else in the game that's like that, right? Unless I'm sorely mistaken. Uh, let's, let me hit Codex here. I don't think so, right? Evan Kill, Data Zahard. So, yeah, I don't think there's any other character similar to this, right? But like, in the future, Bomb is our main character. So, we do, I think, all expect to see uh, different versions of him because obviously he, he upgrades constantly throughout the story he gets stronger as any uh, protagonist would right um and then this will also be our second you know rock right being another one of him so we can always see these like seasonal things pop up and i do wonder how they do it uh in their other game grand cross they do very well on this aspect of it making you like summer waifus or making you uh different variants of that or it could just be flow uh, full-blown cosmetics only correct no sort of seasonal character system or it could be so remember that also yeah we didn't get a summer banner this time it was just summer cosmetics um for summer you did get like two characters that were nothing to do with summer so viol and uh chi shia shia i don't know how people tell, tell me to pronounce her name dude everyone tells me a different thing so for all of those things we kind of know what's coming soon we have an endorse unit we have a rack unit we have an ssr plus sort of i'm guessing that's the collaboration that ssr plus thing right uh, which is which is scary i'm very i'm curious what happens there we have winter banner which also confirms that yes you'll probably get some winter cosmetics there and all that stuff also on the horizon i wonder if they're gonna do anything special for halloween another seasonal thing that is again this game is doing very well also uh, in the global markets so halloween is definitely a uh, again thing that is celebrated in different areas very popularly right so they could easily get some you know you know you know uh, waifu costumes here to make that make that sale because again you saw how summer did for them the summer cosmetics sold very well um so curious on how all those aspects go but again this is there we also had ren in the story over here we, nothing came of him uh so i wonder what happened to him but i wonder if we're actually gonna get him as a character because we're, we're beyond that point but we could see him as a character in the future also um there's a few other characters that again uh, we are we're going to see from leaks that have been mentioned so i am very very much curious on what aspect um of these characters end up releasing so with that wrong wrong game with that <laughs> this video from me i'll catch you in the next one have fun stay safe peace out enjoy uh, let me know if you uh are going to be summoning for any of these characters or are you just full sending it for the uh, the collab you could be doing that a lot of people are they're currently spamming everywhere save 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 so are you in the boat of saving or are you in the boat of wheeling right now on any character you don't give a crap right what are you doing so let me know down below but that's been it for me uh if you want my opinion i'm gonna be saving partially so i'll, I'll talk about that later though but peace out enjoy and yeah it's been it for me